Hey, what's up everybody? Hope you're having a good day. I have a very quick tip. I'm gonna get right to it, not waste your time. Sometimes you'll add a deformer and you'll notice that if we look at the size here, this is X, Y, and Z, but they are all keyframed with one keyframe. So you can't uh, control these individually. But a lot of times you will want to keyframe these separately on the X, Y, Z. You can do that very easily by simply right clicking on this size and then going to user interface and show sub channels. And you'll notice that when I do that, it breaks it down into the X, Y, Z, and it gives you a keyframe for each of these. That way you can control these individually. So you can easily go back to the way it was, just go to user interface and turn off show sub channels and you'll go back to the original way. You can also do this with a cloner with uh, say the count. Anytime you have three options that are all uh, controlled by one keyframe, you should be able to right click on it, go to user interface and go to show sub channels. And now the count on your cloner is broken down into XYZ so you can keyframe them individually. And you can even do this with color. If we have a color option right here, Right now, you can only control the RGB values together with this keyframe, but if we right click on color, go to user interface and show subchannels, it's gonna break down the RGB into their own different keyframes and you can keyframe them separately. So just a really quick tip and uh, maybe it'll come in handy someday. Hope you guys found that useful. Thanks for checking out the Pixlab. Talk to you next time. Ciao.